you surprised to see it gone? Well, I had it so long, I guess so. But uh, I was surprised they dug up the whole thing, you know. A despicable crime that's broken the hearts of a war veteran and everyone who knows him. Uh, thieves stole his patriotic yard display from his Coweta County home, a display his friends call the Freedom Bell. Uh, Fox 5's Doug Evans spoke with Bobby Dearman tonight, who says that bell stood on his property for 30 years. Doug? And he says it was sacred to him. Listen with the national debate over the flag and the anthem and what they mean to so many Americans. This war veteran says, be careful, folks. You don't know what you've got until it's gone. There's something missing from Bobby Dearman's front yard and from his heart, too. The 83-year-old Korean War era vet points to a hole in the ground. That's where his patriotic display used to stand, a big bell on a wooden pole with a large American flag. Someone stole it. Were you surprised to see it gone? Well, I had it so long, I guess so. But uh, I was surprised they dug up the whole thing, you know. He's known in Noonan as Mr. Bobby. The thieves did not get his flag because fortunately it was rainy that day and the Air Force veteran brought it in. I love my flag. His love for the flag and his service to the country are what makes this so heartbreaking for Mr. Bobby's friends. Yeah, uh, the whole post was in the ground. It's a huge post. The bell is huge. I called it the Freedom Bell. He's had it for 30 years, and the flag was big. They dug it and then dug the whole post out of the yard in the middle of the day while he was uh, gone. Friends have been looking for Mr. Bobby's bell at flea markets and yard sales, but with no success. He told me his biggest heartbreak is that he hasn't found a place yet to fly his flag. You miss having the place for it? Yeah, and I'm on find a place.